just want to. Are you for real? This country is crazy. Clear everybody, like clear the whole. It's true, the whole parliament. Exactly. One thirty-seven. One thirty-eight. One thirty-seven. One thirty-nine. I said, I got first class get here. Snap it. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, 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 hey! So, hello, guys, and welcome back again to my YouTube channel. It's your favorite baby girl, okay? <laughs> Ty in the building, yeah, in this building, like this train station right now. So, today, I mean, first off, guys, who would ever, ever believe that? This is something like, can something good come out of Nazareth? I don't know. It's, I'm, I'm joking, right? But for real, though, like, who would ever believe that? something called free can happen in this country nigeria i'm a nigerian and it's not to say that um there are no you know free things somewhere somewhere somehow but i mean i'm i'm so i'm referring to like something general to get like a new a new train station just imagine so yes you probably must have been aware or have known by now and if you don't i'm going to be telling you for free now that the government of Nigeria, federal government of Nigeria, decided to, you know, um, do a bonanza. Should we call it that? Actually, okay. Decided to do a free um, ride by rail transport to, you know, wherever you're going to. Basically, like the most common one, which is like maybe from Lagos to Bado, actually from Lagos to wherever you're going to. So, for this specific period, for I think it's been like 24th of December to probably like it's going to it's going to end 9th of January. So, hurry, hurry, because I don't know, I don't know when this something just like this is going to happen again in this country. <laughs> but I mean, it's a good step, right? It's a good step, and and hopefully we are hoping that. You know it's going to continue and we are just going to get something more and something more good more good stuff as it should be you know them them good roads you know like constant power supply and so many other things you see i've just you're going to be getting to know all of what happened like it was he eventually really really free because to be honest i was skeptical like i held my money intact pay just in case in case in case <laughs> you know <laughs> like in case they change their mind or something fishy fishy went down or something fishy go on and stuff like that so i was prepared like i mean this nigeria like nigeria my dear country anything can happen okay there's nothing impossible so I was really prepared that and actually I, I realized I wasn't the only one. I had some friends, I had some um, you know people, new faces that I met around and you know everybody shared their own part of the story and what they think about this and you know a whole lot of juicy stuff is going to be in this video. So you guys want to sit back and you know enjoy all the process and also I'm going to be sharing everything that transpired, you know, from the beginning to the very end so that you know how to you know look at just look at the crowd guys it's massive like i i really i really appreciate this um you know gesture this thinking or thoughts and <laughs> i don't know it's just it's just unbelievable to be honest i mean it's really really unbelievable i found it so hard to believe yeah definitely as expected it was there was a lot of crowd you gave me so okay so let me let me let me start from the beginning so on this particular day i think it was um yeah this monday 27 but i wanted to go do something briefly in Ibadan, right so i'm like okay why not just take the free train let me see if it's really really free okay so i am proud to that a colleague um, a friend of mine also a youtuber had made a video it's, and in that um you know video i was able to see the schedule of the train and i'm like oh this is so um, informative and helpful like life-saving because the normal the usual um, route the usual time is 8 a.m. in the morning and 4 p.m. in the evening like so but because of this festive season I'm also going to put up the schedule like at the end of the video for you guys to have an idea like a glimpse of everything it was actually you know um, they actually put it 
in the station like in some designated area just for people to be aware of you know the timing so i'm going to put everything at the end of this video so you can just watch to the end so you can see everything and also all the information i'm going to be needing will be right on this day three times like the train was to leave three times in a day compared to the normal two i wanted to go for the one of 12 but um due to some you know errand and runs that was doing in lagos i wasn't able to meet up so i'm like okay so i was done like think about past 11 or yeah i think past 11 to 12 the i got to the train station around around 12 30 to 1 sha so i got there i'm like oh i mean already i already made up my mind i was just going to do the one for four o'clock because i couldn't meet up with the one for 12. I wasn't even prepared like i didn't even vlog i didn't take my phone i just you know just went in just to know how it's going to be done let me know because i mean this is the first time me i'm trying the free ride so let me know how it's done and to be to be sure if it's actually free yeah so i got there just when i got there i realized they were sharing something i didn't even know i just joined the queue <laughs> it wasn't so long it wasn't long at all when i got there it was just about like maybe 10 people there about on the queue right so at that particular time i was the last person that the um of officer handed or is the official you know handed um a paper to and i see that i saw that the paper was containing um what's it called it was containing number yeah so my number was 137 so i'm like oh am i the last i hacked around so i was told that okay you have to get number you know at, at this time i had not packed my load to wow. be honest like i had not packed my my stuff <laughs> i had not so i'm just like let me just give it a try let me see what's going on because i know that there'll be so much crowd That's based on what my friend yeah. had told me right so i'm like if i want to go for the one of four i would definitely not be getting there one hour 30 minutes before the time that that just know that is the next day right <laughs> so i was just let me use this opportunity to just get there and see if i'll be able to meet anything at that time before heading back home to park if i'll be able to meet up so i got there for um for, fortunate but so i got my own number tag and so the man said okay we have to go upstairs at the waiting room yeah you have to get go upstairs at the waiting room to you know just chill and just hold on there till they start calling those numbers get your tickets like the real tickets right so i'm like okay but i wasn't ready to go and sit down and i didn't know the time that they would start doing that so i'm like okay so i asked somebody around so i went to the waiting room and then saw some um you know peeps around i saw some guys there i'm like okay hi hello what um please can you enlighten me like when did they start to call the number? Because as I am, I've not even packed, but fortunately I've got the tag. So the guy was like, okay, that, um, you know, just, if you are going to be doing anything now, ensure that by 1.30 you're already here, like if you go and come back, that they'll start calling the, um, the tags, the numbers, they'll start calling it by 2 o'clock. That, that was what they were told. I'm like, okay, fine. Thanks for the info. So I hurriedly, like I hurriedly went back home to just pack my stuffs right and i got back to the train station around i think um past um 130 few minutes to two actually like 130 something or 140 something was sure like few minutes some minutes to two so i got back and saw the guy he was just like oh wow just inside so we waited when it was like i think two o'clock they started you know we were like okay they announced everybody should go downstairs to get the ticket so so that's what you guys are seeing right now. This is so much crowd. It was this time that everybody was already, you know, downstairs too. So that when they start calling your name, you hear it and then you get the real ticket. So they started calling the figures from number one, two, three. I don't know how they do it, but it was quite fast to be honest. And I was that part was really for me. I was that part was just amazing for me like nigeria orderliness when did this start i'm sorry but to be honest as in i i was happy of course like i was, it was just amazing like in most gathering school you know campuses uh, maybe even airports where you're trying to get visa and all those just majority of the gatherings there's always like this or that it's you know like it's either somebody's trying to rig you know somebody's trying to um cheat and all those stuff but this one was just you know 
it was just going like they were not there was there's no lobbying for anything they were just calling the number like back to back you know when you hear your number you get in right so i was practically i, I actually thought i was the last person until i started hearing 150 and then i saw somebody else 180 i'm like okay okay that's it that's it <laughs> So, but I realized that people are going to different places here. Yeah? So, people are going to Abiokuta from Lagos, some people are going to Ibadan and they like. So, that explains the, you know, numbers. And then, because I was already scared that I hope, I was already scared that I hope I was going to, you know, like, even people with those high numbers, they're like, ah, how many sitters? And then I also realized that some of the coaches are 88 sitter, like the one of standard, you know, it's, it's first class that it does lesser, um, numbers because the spaces between the you know um, seats are quite much as per first class right and then, so that's it okay so <coughs> things you would like to you know know before going there is if you are going prepare yourself ensure that you get there like very early like if the train is scheduled for 12 at least at most actually at most by 10 you should be there for real like people are always more you know it's free and it's festive season so you should get here on time then you should check that you know schedule i'm going to put at the end of this video so that you can know the exact time on that day that you that you would plan towards or plan for so you don't miss it then again um ensure that you go with your national id card like basically identification card i didn't know i wasn't aware of this because the first time i don't think it was asked i can't remember but I, I don't think it was required it wasn't but this time i was ha it was asked you know something to identify you i didn't have any you know government identification or um, a card with me with me but then thankfully i had my work id card so that was just what i used and you know it was accepted so in case if you don't have that with you you can also use your id card your work id card some people also use their school id card something to just identify you right so that's that's it meanwhile it's important that you take the physical one along nigerians will always be nigerians at least some nigerians you know they take advantage of some i don't know this guy the process okay. of trying to get by so apparently uh, this guy is beside me soft copy the lady was like don't worry don't worry oh. just she was she actually forced me to tip her like what i have like, oh wow like, don't worry, don't worry. are you serious you that's another thing just are you for real? This country is crazy. As in interesting. I just unlocked my phone. I was bringing out my. Where do I say it's free? Of it. like, soft copy. She was like, don't worry, what's your name? I told them my name. She wrote it behind my, my ticket. I said, don't worry. Just give us a crazy last time. Wow. <laughs> I can't show that the ID number. It was like, he didn't, have the, he didn't have his physical copy with him, but he had the e copy, like he had it on his phone. So I was trying to look for it when she was asked, and then that the lady said he shouldn't worry, but then wrote at the back of the ticket that give us something for Christmas now, you know, something like you you get what I mean. So they see how to collect something. I'm just like, how do people think you am um, something that I'm taking for free, and then you're like, I should give you something on it, but it's it, it is what it is. Wow, are you Okay, thank you. Oh my god, I didn't know I was supposed to jump. <laughs> this is so crazy. Hi guys, so I finally got in. Let me see, where's the camera? This is camera, okay. I finally got in my ticket number 137. Okay, so for now, because I've got a ticket, I can walk slowly, I can make video, I can do anything I like because <laughs> I've got to buy tickets. I've been thinking, I, I actually thought I was the last person. 137, alas, I saw 150. Ah, I'm hearing 180. Wow. Okay, anyways, that's it. So we are back at the waiting room and I'm going to be waiting till 4 o'clock. The time right now is about past 2 or 3. Yeah, so we are going to be waiting just to rest at the waiting room so i'm going to see you guys maybe in the train or at omi adio Kacha. Sorry. what you can carry 13 people mm -hmm. this thing small ah 13 <laughs> 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 inside life 
they are not even COVID, they are compliant. Right, I even had to just, you know, I tried to just with some of those people I met around while waiting. We had a lot of, you know, fun times. So they are always <laughs> there and stuff. It was just really nice. Yeah, this thing is possible. Yeah. Possible. Sincerely, I didn't believe they it really, until I connected really, this. Yeah, they really <laughs> I didn't believe it. If they are wise enough to invest in this railway system yeah. People as an will, alternative will really, yes, transportation, yes. man, traffic will reduce in Lagos. I said, I, said, I got first class get here, snap it. <laughs> snap it, let me snap and see. I'm super <laughs> Sincerely, because yes, people don't, understand. People don't believe to, it's unbelievable to be honest. People are trying to, if like, everybody believed this place would be filled like water, honestly. Like ah. I didn't even know it was actually free. Me, I did. I, me, I, I, I heard too, but I, I didn't came, believe. I came with the mindset to buy my ticket. Yes. Yes. <laughs> a guy was holding the cash. Take your money. Oh my god. Yeah. Wow. And then it was a smooth ride as usual. You should watch my previous, um, you know, video to get the full gist. But if you've not seen that video, just look up, right up. Oh yeah, that side exactly. That's it. <laughs> but it's also to note that it was actually totally free. Eh? Uh, who eh? Serious price. The last time was seven seven k because it was it was very really late. They'll just be charging you as in. So I wanted to get down at the Omi Adiu station, but then this um, some of these guys had, were like, oh, they are, there's actually some buses now that the government provides at the, you know, the station at Monia that it takes you that I think um, it's 300 naira to any any place you are going to from that Monia station. So I'm like, oh, really? Compared to the boat that they will just surge everything and you'll be hearing 7k, 4k and stuff to just where you know that it won't cost you almost, it won't even cost you 1k to get to where you are going to. They'll just hype the price so i decided like okay let me alight at money yeah, again this time i'm thinking that it's going to go well trust me guys i'm going to show you the bus please do not i repeat do not okay like don't bother except you because so i now see the reason why i see people running you know when they get down i'm always like like the last time i was like why are they running now i'm like okay let me try and run because they're running i don't know <laughs> so apparently they were running to catch up with the bus you know see again i repeat once you get to that bus and you see that maybe it's filled, just back out, just back out because you don't want to, you know, you want to avoid a situation. You don't want to find yourself in a situation that you don't like. So please, just avoid it. Otherwise, you find yourself maybe like standing till you get to where you are going to. Uh, of everything, everything. When things are just like this now, I've never experienced this since I've been in Nigeria. The free free train, I've me too, never. Anything free. <laughs> never. I'm even surprised, I'm amazed. Yeah. yeah. People will start relaxing. Yeah. I hope so. Like what is it? Yes, yes, that's true. Of course they can. More than nine days. Wow. Nine. Wow. Wow. So it's actually something possible and feasible. It is. We are just it inconvenience is. ourselves. It is. It's just that um, you know our leaders. Ah. Oh. Hmm. This is just is like a pilot study. Clear every like clear the whole. It's true. The whole parliament. Exactly. <laughs> Total overall. That's the word. Exactly. Except they want to do that. Uh -huh. If not, all those babas are left. All those that they called. They will frustrate your efforts. <laughs> I'm surprised that ah, if there's any nothing that they that they are successful at in this place, it's leaving four o'clock on the like. how To show you how the Japanese are time conscious. There was there was this, um, a certain time the, the train came twenty seconds earlier yeah. than the normal time. Oh wow! So some people missed the train and they apologized. Oh, they were wow. actually twenty seconds. 
20 earlier. seconds earlier. <laughs> that's crazy. So that's how time controls they are. You don't joke with time. Yeah. You train is living by four. It's living by four. So it's a, this thing is not it's not rocket science. It's actually achievable. It is. Just it is. That. I don't, but why? And the, to yeah, that's the word because it's I don't understand. Word. Like, is this scary to do? Is this so? It's so it's, it's sincerely, I'm surprised. Yeah. I've been hearing the rumor of fit train. I'm like, hmm? Niger. I heard it, child, but I didn't, I didn't believe it. Like, I just came with the mindset to buy my ticket. Yeah. So he, he was even on the other side. It's free. I'm like, are you serious? As in, <laughs> that was that was why I didn't stay at the first class because I'm like, they can change their mind. <laughs> The I don't to trust this case. You know, as Nigerians that ah, maybe they can change their mind or whatnot. So it's just people that are like the like these two guys beside me are like oh, what so they took they went for the first class. You know, there's this thing at the back of your mind like ah, let me I don't know, let me just do what I can pay for. I don't I don't know, I don't know. But that was just but this is to say that if you are if you are going Please, by all means, it is free. It is totally free. Until they tell you that, okay, maybe first class ticket is finished, then you can back out or back off. But if not, please go and queue in the first class. Let's see see how it is. It's free, okay? It's your father's money. I'm oh, sorry, I'm joking. I mean, like, it's it's your country's, you know, property. You pay the tax for it, okay? <laughs> I mean, you're entitled to it, by all means. So, yeah. Um, that's 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 just it. This country is crazy. As an interesting. I just unlocked my phone. I was bringing out my. What why copy. is this free? Of, like soft copy. It was like, don't worry. What's your name? Put them on the shirt. Ruth behind my my ticket. So don't worry. Just give us Christmas. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do that. The This is last time. That's the problem. Yeah. <laughs> Just imagine, as in, imagine budding something, you're picking something for free, but then you're asking, yes, what's the correlation? Ah, oh no, we are, is it, oh, this country is going to <laughs> To charge? Yes, sell it. yes, yes, exactly, they will sell it and collect the money and put it in their pocket. It's not to shade Nigerians or whatnot. Different, yes. I That's what I'm saying. Not, that not it's not Nigerian alone. alone. Exactly. Chinese are the ones doing it Nigerian most part. Because the typical Nigerian. Yes. Want to make money. Yes. 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 And as a matter of, I see that you might have maybe like start selling it way before. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'm going to see you in my next one. Bye. I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.